Let's go ahead and talk about whatever you're comfortable sharing about the second anointing. My sense is that my, our listeners would love as much detail as you're comfortable providing, even if it's repetitive to what Tom Phillips shared. For those who have never listened, we did an interview with Tom Phillips, who is a British gentleman who served, I think, as stake president twice, worked with the area, and then eventually received this ordinance called the second anointing. Please go back and listen to that. It's definitely in our top three most popular episodes of all time. But don't don't feel like you need to worry about repetition. What can you tell us about, number one, how you even maybe were selected? Because we remember from the Tom Phillips interview, one of the, you know, for those who don't know, the second anointing is this special secret ordinance that uh, Mormons can receive if they're kind of reaching the upper echelons of leadership or financial contribution to the church, frankly. And um, it's this ordinance where you go to the temple and um, you're basically, as I understand it, promised that you've arrived at the celestial kingdom and you're sort of, you're calling an election is made sure. Now, I, you know, other people may see technical difficulties, but generally it's this idea of being sealed up to the celestial kingdom and eventually sort of a promise of you arriving at the state of godhood. And it's a secret ceremony and uh, but it's viewed as sacred and and we're encouraged never to talk about it and it's been held as secret. So that's just a little bit of background. But one of the things Tom Phillips told us in that interview was that as he was, uh, you know, either receiving or had experienced and received his second anointing along with his wife, he was called into a meeting with the general authority where he was asked to give names of other potential candidates to receive the second anointing. So. I think I remember him feeling like that was a bit odd, that it was almost like like a pyramid kind of thing where you're giving more names so that other people can then know who they should consider for what should be sort of a an inspired revelation that comes from God. Anyway, do you have any insight into kind of how you may have been recommended for that position, or would you not have any insight into that? Actually, I don't really know. Yeah. But I can... Uh, I think maybe it had to do with a rasp and give a recommendation for once, just a few months before that, I asked him, I heard about something called a second endowment or second... You endowment. asked about it? Yeah. How had you heard about it? Because, I th well, I can I don't remember how really, but some, you can read in, in the, some of the McConkies. Mormon doctrine. Yeah. yeah. Or you can read that Christ was the feet of the apostles. And somewhere I understood there was something, but I didn't really know about it. So I asked him, why can I read more about it? And had you ever heard of anyone receiving it in life as an area authority? Had you ever, you're three years into your calling. Mm -hmm. Had you ever known of anyone receiving it or heard of anyone receiving it? <sighs> You know, I didn't know, but I heard in some way that my mother was in there, was there, and but I didn't know. That it, maybe your mom had received it. Yeah. But you weren't sure? No. Okay, because you're told not to tell but your I kids. But can, I can put uh, two plus two, and that will be four, and that's the way I know about it, but... Uh, or at least understood that was something like that. Had your parents served as temple presidency no, or, no, or no, mission no. presidents? No, or my state dad presidents? was a district president. Uh, okay. Yeah. And you thought that maybe your mom had received it? Yes. Okay. Sometime. So you asked Rasband about it? Yeah, and he didn't, he didn't like to talk about it at all. What did he, he say? Yeah, well, I can't really remember, but he didn't say anything really because he was not supposed to say it. Okay. And afterwards, when I was there, I understood why, because I hadn't received it <laughs> either. He, he had not received it? No. Are you... Oh. <laughs> Ta-da. It's not in the book. <laughs> wow. Okay. So he hadn't received it yet? No. Wow. Okay. 